Sharks are some of the most intimidating creatures on the planet. They date back to roaming the seas over 400 million years ago, and from that time on, they've been a formidable predator in the deep blue. With a lifespan of 20 to 30 years on average, and a top speed of 31 miles per hour, sharks have consistently been nightmare fuel for centuries. Although humans definitely aren't their primary food source, there's been a handful of accidents where a shark's mouth and a human body have come in contact, and a few of those have been caught on camera. So, in this video, we're going to be taking a look at 10 shark attacks that were caught on film. But before we go ahead and get into that, if you guys are brand new here to the channel, make sure you go ahead and subscribe with your channel notifications turned on. After doing that, be sure to comment down below saying I subscribed or hashtag notification squad for your chance to be featured in our video shout out at the end of the month where you guys can actually get your name and comments featured in a video and on screen for everyone else watching to see and if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to give it a big old thumbs up now without further ado let's go ahead let's jump in and take a look at 10 shark attacks caught on film number one Mick Fanning must be wearing the wrong cologne because he's had multiple encounters with sharks that he barely escaped from the first incident happened in 2015 during a surfing competition held in South Africa. In the opening minutes of the final heat, a shark was spotted circling Mick as he waded in the water. After nearly escaping the jaws of the beast, Mick was pulled onto a safety boat where he could be seen hugging his friends and family in relief. Immediately following this incident, the remainder of that surfing competition was cancelled. Then in 2017, when Mick was out surfing on the South African coast once again, another shark was spotted near Mick and his fellow surfers, and they once again had to be picked up by a safety boat. This time, however, the shark retreated and the competition was able to resume. Number 2. While this shark attack might not be nearly as brutal as some of the others in this video, it's equally as terrifying. Typically, a boat is what stands between you and a shark, and it more so signifies safety than anything else when dealing with sharks. But what happens when the shark tries eating the boat? This is exactly what happened here as this shark was caught gnawing on the side of this boat for minutes as spectators looked on nervously. That's not good! Get the rope! Bugger! Number three, yet another barrier created to enforce safety when dealing with sharks is a shark cage. These cages allow divers to get up close and personal with marine life, including sharks, without the risk of being completely unprotected. However, most of these shark tanks are sort of a one-size-fits-all, which means some smaller or skinnier sharks might be able to penetrate the cage's openings. That is what happened in this incident, where a diver in a shark cage had a shark nearly join him for a brief moment, as the shark charged the cage and its head and upper half of its body actually made its way inside. Luckily for this diver, and all the spectators watching in shock, the shark wasn't able to completely enter the cage and it was quickly scared away. Was there anybody in there? Number 4. Shark fishing is not for the faint of heart, and I think this guy might have spent a few weeks enjoying a safer hobby on land before returning out to sea. During a shark fishing retreat, this fisherman can be seen in an intense standoff between himself and the shark that's on the end of his line. All caught on camera, you can see the fisherman fighting with all of his might to reel in the beast. Unfortunately though, the shark gets the better of him and pulls him into the water. Luckily, the man was able to escape the shark without any injuries, but it was certainly a close one. One more second in the water and this guy could have had a serious nightmare on his hands. Number 5. 
Number five, what's worse than one great white shark? That's right, two great white sharks, which is exactly what this surfer had to deal with when he was out riding the waves. Shannon Ainsley, the surfer involved here, was enjoying his day off the coast of South Africa when not one but two great white sharks appeared in the water surrounding him. The area Shannon was surfing in was a popular shark feeding ground, but also an incredible place to catch some waves according to the local surfers, but in this case the risk might not have been worth the reward. When reaching the crest of a wave, two shark fins can be seen within feet of Shannon and his board, and moments later the sharks collide sending Shannon into the air before being surged under the water. One of the sharks grabs Shannon's hand as he enters the water and begins to drag him down. Moments later though, Shannon can be seen barely alive on the shore, bleeding heavily. Luckily, Shannon was able to survive the encounter, but it did cost him 30 stitches. Oddly enough, it was actually the second shark that saved Shannon's life here, as when it went to attack Shannon while the first shark had a hold of his hand, the second shark actually knocked him free, allowing him to barely get away. Number 6. Ever wonder what it might look like encountering a shark just a few inches away from you? Well, now you can, as this first person at point of view shows a diver fending off a shark that is vigorously swarming him. This reef shark seemed extra interested in this diver as he was frantically swinging at the shark with his rod, the only mechanism of defense that this diver actually had. Fortunately, the shark did eventually back off and the diver escaped unharmed. Justin, get my gun! Get my gun, I have a fucking chunk out of my leg. Number seven. This shark attack once again happens as the result of a shark cage being open enough for a shark to slip in. These divers had an up close and personal encounter with this shark that, after charging the shark cage, made its way into the shark cage with the divers. Even worse, during the panic, both of the divers involved lost their regulators, leaving them only a few moments until they ran out of air. One diver was actually able to escape the cage by exiting the same window that the shark entered through, and seconds later when the shark lunged at the second diver, it bumped him hard enough to shove him out of the cage and into the arms of safety. Number 8. Beware, this clip is a little bit bloody. This unsuspecting swimmer is suddenly face to face with a vicious bull shark that's hungry and willing to take a chunk out of anything available, including this man's calf. The bull shark in this case ends up sneaking up behind the swimmer, biting his leg and then begins to thrash him around, leaving the swimmer barely alive and unconscious. Although the swimmer here lost a lot of blood and a chunk of his leg, he was able to make it out alive. Number 9. Ever wanted to kiss a shark? Well, if you answered yes, um, I, I have serious questions for you, but you also might not want to after seeing this clip where a shark trainer tried to perform a trick with a quote-unquote tame shark. When leaning in to kiss this shark, the trainer unexpectedly got a kiss back, and it was not a nice one. When pressing his lips against the shark, this trainer's mouth was suddenly bitten by the shark, and the shark seemingly sucks the trainer's entire face into his mouth. Luckily, the trainer was able to break free rather quickly and escape without any major injuries. The problem starts when Dave tries something he hasn't done before. Number 10. To wrap things up, we figured we'd throw in a little bit more of a light-hearted shark attack, if you want to call it that. This actually ends in the laughs from everyone involved. These guys, enjoying some time out in the ocean, were messing around off the side of their boat when a shark actually swam right up to the side, actually hitting one of the guys with its tail fin. Fortunately for the swimmer, the shark was more curious rather than hungry and just seemed to be investigating the boat and later swam away. And there you guys have it, those are 10 shark attacks caught on a film. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a big old thumbs up, slap that like button, it would be much appreciated. And if you guys are brand new here to the channel, make sure you go ahead and subscribe with your channel notifications turned on by clicking that little bell icon. By doing that every single time we upload a new video in the future, YouTube will actually send you a message letting you know we've gone live so you can be the first person to watch, like, and comment on each and every new post. 
Speaking of commenting, if you guys are just now joining that notification squad, let us know down below by leaving a comment saying I subscribed or hashtag notification squad for your chance to be featured in our video shout out at the end of the month where you guys can actually get your name and comment on a screen. Once again, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Until next time, take it easy, have an awesome rest of your day, and we will see you guys later.